Mark, it must be lunchtime. We're starting to see people coming in here at the Kenton County Public Library to cast some of their votes. I'm going to step out of the shot here just so you can see. Uh, there are a few people up there as uh, candidates Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton are facing off today in a bluegrass showdown. It's been a fairly light turnout so far today. About 50 or so people have already come here to vote. Voter turnout estimated to be about 20 percent today. Bernie Sanders so far has gained support from young Democrats while Clinton has made the most of her connections in the Commonwealth. Clinton has not been received well in the eastern part of the state where coal thrives and many blame Democrats for a decline in the industry. We spoke with the very first voter here this morning and she says she's feeling the burn. Even if he doesn't win, he fought to the very end and that means a lot to me and you know, even if he doesn't win, which I you know, hope he does, it means a lot to me because he, he's fighting for us. To me, he's fighting for the average person. Now, while the battle between Hillary Clinton and Bernie Sanders plays out at the polls today, there are also other issues at hand. Republicans are voting on local issues and candidates here. And uh, there's also plenty of attention in that race, the U.S. Senate race as well. We'll, of course, keep covering this for you throughout the afternoon, bringing you the latest information as we get it. For now, we're live here in Covington. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.